Good day, friends. It is me, HL Mod Tech, and I am back with another fantastic Tinkercad tutorial. So let's get cracking. Today, Tinkercad has blessed us with a brand new Tinkercad workspace. Let's check it out. Looking at our homepage, we initially get to see all our designs. Notice if we click on the view more on my large screen, I have now got a ton of designs shown and the icons are epically large. One thing to note is that when I clicked on show more designs, it bounced me to the designs category. Let's bounce back to home and check out new things. We have got a create button over there. Notice when we go to the designs button, we've got create and we've got search and we've got a brand new recycle bin. No longer are your designs immediately gone when you hit delete. That is a fantastic addition to our toolbox. Notice we now have a multi-select box and with one click, we can sort by when things were edited, created, or by file name. I also like that the search button shows up here. I used to search and sometimes it would check my classrooms instead of designs. I think this makes it much more clear to have it actually show up in the designs area. Of course, with a simple click, you can switch to circuits or code blocks and back and forth. Also, you can switch to collections. If you have not used collections yet, they are a fantastic way to organize your projects. The one thing that I wish is that there was a way we could share collections. Files in the collection could maintain their normal sharing properties, but say it would be an easy way for users to see all the variations of crankies I had created using one link. I have a tutorial about collections I'll make sure I put up here in the corner if you've never tried them out. If you click tutorials, those are the ones you've completed. Same thing with challenges. These are the challenges that I've completed. If we look over here in the right corner, we can instantly get to the challenges. These are fantastic open-ended projects that last a few weeks. And of course, Tinkercad shares fun results on all their social media platforms. Let's quickly use that search button and track down the HLMT23 tag. If you share a design with this in the properties or the tags, I check these out every day and of course I will give you a reaction. There have been so many fantastic designs. You can check these out at any time. At the moment you can see it was sorted by relevance. You can also switch to recent and you can switch to trending or you can even switch to sorted by reactions. Just remember friends when you're checking these out, it's even cooler if you click on each other's designs and take a moment to give them reactions as well. Of course, friends, if you see any of my designs, if you click on them, those reactions are always appreciated. And if you check the details, you'll likely find a video. If not, make sure you check the images. If you're ever interested in seeing all of a user's designs, don't forget, you can simply click on their username just like that. They will initially be sorted by recent, so you can see what they've been creating. You can also instantly sort by reactions. And since we're checking out my designs, whatever you see, if you click on it, there is likely a tutorial. Of course, it will be full of useful Tinkercad skills, and when you're done, you will have created something awesome. Let's quickly back out to that new Tinkercad workspace, though. And let's do a quick review. I like this order. Notice there is also a little button so we can collapse it to give ourselves even more room in our Tinkercad workspace. And I'd like to officially say I like the changes that we've got today, but I think it'd be even cooler to see in the comments of this video what your thoughts are about these Tinkercad workspace changes. Finally, friends, if you enjoyed the video, please give it a like. Please also hit that share button so more people can learn about HL Mod Tech. Of course, friends, don't forget you absolutely make my day if you take time to leave a comment down below. And if you haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Smash that subscribe button. And last but not least, hit that notification bell if you want to be the first to know when there's a brand new video from me, HL Mod Tech. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.